A data sprint, uh, like, uh, like other kind of sprint forms, is this uh, short burst of work, right? Where people from very often different uh, areas, different skill sets come together uh, around uh, a case, a research question, and uh, try to um, you know, provide some answers, provide uh, descriptions to better understand that case through, uh, through data analysis. I think the fundamental reason why the data sprint is important is because so much of our social lives are taking place within datafied contexts. So that could be in social media like Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, etc. So if we're not studying the data that's being produced by people in their everyday lives, that's hard to kind of get a picture of a lot of the large questions that social scientists and digital humanities and other folks are trying to ask. In many ways, digital methods is a, a broader strategy to deal with the you know, technological changes in our society. So it can be a, a way to indeed answer research questions, but it also can be a way to build one's literacy about uh, online spaces, about the digital. You know, digital methods has also this kind of reflexivity to it, right? I mean, it, it, you're not just using it as a tool, but also reflecting on it how it mediates our access to that data and also to understand how computational uh, tools and platforms, how they are also mediating social relations nowadays. Data sprint, very interesting in the context of digital methods research, it's uh, a drawing on methodologies that are not fully worked out. It's not like you have uh, um, very easy recipes that you can just execute. So very often when you deal with data uh, retrieved from the internet, you have to try out things, you have to collect ideas, you have to see which data can you get, which data can you not get. And at the end of the sprint, maybe you don't have full findings, but you have a, a number of ideas that you can then work out in, uh, in more details later. To me, the process is, is the most important and, and the exchanging, exchanging ideas and exchanging expertise with, e with each other and learn uh, with each other. So I think that network's also a really good thing for people, they have people to connect with and research, research with after the data sprint as well. So it's a starting point rather than an ending point. I think that from this topic that I'm working here, which is connected to feminism, uh, I think this um, event can actually uh, help me to connect the dots. The data sprint approach is something really useful for, for us. I mean, I'm a designer and we work with uh, different people from different backgrounds. So I think that the data sprint is something really useful to understand how to manage a lot of tools and diff every time different topics. Well, we found out that this amount of data can tell us new things about our perspective and actually gives insights. So we social scientists can go deeper in some research questions in a way that we wouldn't uh, if it wasn't this opportunity to work in an interdisciplinary team and with other views that know health and social sciences. Mm -hmm.